Hi there, I'm Paul Spooner, and I'm going to show you me taking apart a graphics card. But don't get any ideas, because I know what you're thinking. Um, let's do this. So here's the graphics card. It's a GTX GeForce 960 4GB G1 Gaming OC Edition. And uh, it worked great for about four years, and then it stopped working. So I'm going to take it apart. You take it apart by uh, these screws here. There's six screws on the back uh, for around the main processor, and then uh, those ones, and then for um, down, lower down. So yeah, that's what it looks like, and uh, it's pretty easy to take apart. You don't have to do much. You just pull the screws out and, you know, so let's do that. I'm using a, a WOW stick, I think. It's a you know, thing from China. It's a powered screwdriver. It's pretty nice. I, I've been pretty pleased with it. Battery powered. Uh, saves you all the hassle of twisting it around. You still have to break it free yourself. It doesn't have a huge amount of torque, but uh, once you've broken the screws free, it works really well. So yeah, you take these six screws out and the whole thing basically just comes apart. Um, now I've taken this apart before, so I unplugged all the, the cables. Uh, so they're already unplugged already, but if you were doing this yourself, uh, all you do is take those screws apart and then break the thermal paste free. Uh, drop your screws on the desk. Let's let's clean those up. Uh, the the Wow Stick package came with a, a very nice little magnetic mat. So uh, yeah, there it is. That is the whole thermal handling unit, and uh, you can see the thermal paste here. That's more like a gel. This is paste, and then these are also gel. I don't know what all these components are. It looks like there's like a main processor and then two sub-processors and then some memory. That's my guess. Um, I think those are the, the sub-processors, but those have some thermal damage on them, which I think is why the, the card died. So let's take a closer look at that. The uh, the thermal damage looks like it, it's kind of a, a slight discoloring. I don't know if you can see it very well on the video, but you should be able to pick it out. You can see it right there. Uh, looks like it burned the the board a bit around the corners of the device, and I don't know if that's just from the device heating up. There, that one's pretty bad, or if that actually denatured the the epoxy. I think it's an epoxy glass or something. Uh, anyway, if it denatured that, or if the components died themselves, or if the traces died on the board. If the traces died, then it should be possible to repair this board. Uh, think about selling it on eBay. It doesn't work at all, but uh, it doesn't mean that nobody could fix it. It seems like probably just a component or two are bad and the rest works fine, but no telling which ones those are. At least I can't tell. So uh, yeah, there it is. Comes right apart. It's easy to, to pop open. Um, yeah, all the, the heat pipes are still good as far as I can tell. So those all run fine. Uh, wick away the heat. Fans all still run. It still lights up. Uh, well, I mean, I took the lights off, but yeah, it's just about it's just about all there is to it. Dead graphics card. It's a pretty simple device, really. I mean, it's all 